He's the CEO of Adpro. He's Mario Fuentes. Every time I see this little toy, I remember my grandfather. His name was Alfredo. He was a lively, visionary, and tenacious man. And his company, which is our company now, and which used to make toys, was imbued with his personality. Thanks to my grandfather, our company evolved and improved more and more until they stopped making toys to start making other kinds of products. For several years, they keep changing their production line until they ended up in automobile industry, developing new parts for other companies in this sector. When they changed their production line, he gave me the last toy they made, which coincidentally is this toy car. I play with this little car for many years. I always keep it with me until I accidentally broke it. I tried to fix it. I even asked my dad, who was the new chief of the company, if he could fix it. But as they had changed their production line, there was no way of fixing it. As years went by, and after studying a lot, I was in charge of our company. I started working around the clock, trying to find new ways, thinking about new horizons. I wanted our company to keep evolving. I have always been told that I look like him. Without a doubt, I felt inspired by him. At that moment, I discovered it. A new technology, additive manufacturing. It opened a whole new world of possibilities an invaluable potential. Not only did I manage to fix this toy, but I also discovered that we could implement this new technology in our productive process. Reducing cost and time in processes, being able to be innovative, obtain new designs and produce other types of products. It was clear for us, we started to use additive manufacturing. Thanks to this, we started to develop a new type of service. The substitution of our physical parts warehouses for virtual parts warehouses. And this was how we managed to stand out from the rest of our sector. Not only did we improve our production, with the resources we save in the production process, we could expand the investment in our R&D department to keep evolving. Thanks to additive manufacturing technology, we opened the door to a new whole world of possibilities. <laughs>